why this is your mayor. Here is a nice project for a baby shower. A cradle made from a watermelon is ideal if the baby shower happens in the summer. Filled with a fruit salad, it makes a very refreshing dessert. First of all, choose a nice watermelon with a rather elongated shape and not round like a ball. Often the side on which the watermelon lid in the field is a little flatter and pale green. To make sure the cradle is stable, I will cut a thin slice of watermelon from this side without getting into the pink flesh of the watermelon. Place the watermelon on its flat base. Mark the cradle and hood with masking tape. Since I wanted to create the curvy hood, I drew the curves on the masking tape with a pencil. Cut out the hood by following the masking tape you have placed. If you create curves like me, first make a straight cut with a big knife so you can cut out the details with a small knife later. Then make the horizontal cut for the cradle. As soon as you remove the piece of the watermelon, you can see the shape of the cradle with its hood coming out of the melon. If you have drawn curves for the hood, cut them now with a small knife. Now, empty the watermelon. I started by using a melon spoon to make balls, of which I will use some in the fruit salad. The larger your watermelon, the longer it takes to empty. Try to empty the watermelon until you almost get to the pale green rind of the melon. But don't go too far in the bottom of the melon to avoid making a leak. To fill the cradle, you will start by preparing the baby's head. To represent the baby's head, you will need a cantaloupe. Cut the cantaloupe in half and take one of the halves. Remove the seeds and peel off the skin so that you end up with a pale orange half sphere. Start by making a small hole for the mouth. The hole must be large enough to fit a baby pacifier. For the eyes, use blueberries that you fix in place with toothpicks. For the nose and ears, take the other half of the cantaloupe and cut three balls with the melon spoon. Cut one ball in half for the nose and place it just above the pacifier. Use a toothpick to hold it in place. For the ears you will also need two half balls that you fix in place on both sides of the head with toothpicks. The head is ready now. Prepare a large fruit salad. Spread a thin layer of fruit salad in the bottom of the cradle. Put the baby's head in place under the hood of the crib. Continue filling the cradle with fruit salad. To represent the blanket over the fruit, I used pineapple slices. I covered each pineapple hole with kiwi slices and finished with half balls of watermelon. In the empty spaces between pineapple slices, you can add raspberries, for example. The combination of pineapple, kiwi, watermelon balls and raspberries gives the baby blanket beautiful contrasting colors. And finally, if you want to make a baby carriage instead of a cradle, add wheels. I cut grapefruit slices to form the wheels. Attach two slices of grapefruit on each side of the watermelon with two sticks. Add a grape so that the slices stay in place. And there, your baby carriage is complete. Put it on a nice plate for serving. This dessert is a guaranteed success. 
Don't forget to subscribe to our Anima Plates YouTube channel and also click on the little bell to be notified as soon as a new video is published. To access the printed document, register on the Anima Plates website. See you soon!